decided to go to a Goodwill. Don't tell my wife because I ain't supposed to be here. <laughs> it's going for anywhere between 100, well, 80 to 100. And Sonic the Hedgehog 2 for Sega Genesis. Crazy, let's go. And then that big score on that camera, they slipped on that one, but I'll take that. This is X's house, what is up my family? It's Monday morning, I have 16 orders to pull and pack. So let's get right into it. First order I actually pulled yes last night. Um, it was in the backyard in a working box as these Solomon XA Pros. They're size five and they sold for $22 plus shipping. So the next two orders is in the CL12 in this bin right here. And it's gonna be, this is the first one right here. This is it's a Nike uh, polo, brand new with tags, and this one sold for $25 plus shipping. All right, so after after some digging, I found it, and it's gonna be this Iron Horse shirt right here. It's from 2014, and it sold for $12 plus $5.50 in shipping. And since I got this opened up, I'm gonna go ahead and grab these hats that I need. So I got this Stevo hat that sold for $15 free shipping, and then this SpaceX hat that sold for $12.74 plus $5.50 shipping. And I got both of these hats for $2 a piece at Goodwill. I paid $8 for these, $1 for the shirt, and $5 for the Nike shirt. Our next sale is a pretty decent one. I got, I sold this uh, Wilson Sledge 2.8 for $25 plus $15 in shipping. I picked this up for, I believe like, two dollars and fifty cents or something like that so pretty good sale all right next sale is right over here and it's this little batman figure it's missing pieces and it's sold for uh 8.94 or something like that free shipping so not a big sale but i got this in a bag of toys from goodwill and usually i pick those up for about in between three dollars and six so and there was more stuff in there so i'm uh I'm getting into the profit on that bag. All right, the next sale is actually back over here, and it's this Guitar Hero Explorer guitar for Xbox 360. And I almost left this one behind because it's all jacked up, but I sold it for parts and repair. Yeah, so $35 plus $15 in shipping. So not, not a bad sale because I got this for $5 at Goodwill. All right, next sale is a really good one because I got it for free. And it's gonna be in this bin. It's actually, these uh, Air Max slides. And my wife bought these for me for Christmas and they didn't fit. So we got our money refunded and they didn't want the slides back. So got them for free and they sold for $80 plus $11.50 in shipping. All right, next sale is in this bin right here, CL6. And it's going to be this shirt right here. Uh, it's a Beatles revolver shirt, and this sold for $13 plus $5.50 shipping. And I paid, I think, $2 for that one. And it's going to be this glove right here. I believe I paid $7 for this one, and it sold for $55 plus $11.50 in shipping. So, pretty good sale there. I'm pretty sure I mentioned this before, but baseball gloves and baseball uh, like uh, equipment like bats, gloves, bats and gloves usually do really well. You just got to make sure you uh, look at the model number because there's a lot of gloves that do not are not worth nothing. But there's a lot of gloves that are worth something like that one that's uh, went from seven to 50. So I'm happy about that sale and on to the next one. This pull, Bullseye's Funko Pop from Toy Story actually sold for $17 free shipping and I paid $4 for it so I'm happy about that. Don't mind this mess, this is all the stuff that I gotta um, actually process today. So. I got some work to do today. All right, another good sale is actually gonna be Resident Evil Director's Cut. It's missing the manual, it's missing the demo disc and it's still sold for $40 plus $5.50 in shipping. So it was a really good sale and it's all profit. All right, so the next two sales is actually in, gonna be in this CL7 bin. So it's good, definitely gonna be this Izod, Izod Lacoste uh, little cardigan sweater. 
got the little gator and um it's definitely vintage and this sold for ten dollars plus 11.50 in shipping all right and the next one is going to be this brooks brothers it's a long sleeve yellow shirt it's a uh, vintage with the little pig um it's a polo this one sold for twelve dollars plus 550 in shipping and both of those shirts i paid 50 cent for all right and this next sale i'm pretty hyped about because i sold all four of these uh little transformers figures um for 25 dollars plus shipping and i bought these in a little bag at goodwill i really didn't know if they were worth much but they ended up being worth a little decent chunk of change so i'm happy about that that's all the orders for today now it's time for my favorite part packing all that stuff up <laughs> i'm playing with you that's like the worst part all right I, it's tuesday now um yesterday i like what i like to do on mondays is go ahead and process everything i got the week before so i'm taking pictures putting stuff up um and that's what i do on mondays so it's tuesday and i'm i had a, a doctor's appointment today and i decided to go to a goodwill don't tell my wife because i ain't supposed to be here <laughs> but i'm gonna go in here and try to make some money baby all right, first thing I found is this bag uh, with a PlayStation 2 fishing reel controller. I've never seen that before. And it also has like a extension for the PlayStation 2 controller and a regular um, genuine PlayStation 2 controller for $5.99. And I should be able to get at least uh, $20 for that for that fishing reel. I, it's too bad I don't got that blue one, but it's all good. I'll take it. And I think I'm going to go ahead and pick up this jvc camcorder here um they're charging 12.99 but if it's working i could get uh, like a hundred dollars and even if it's not working i should be able to get about 30 so i'll take it i'll take the chance all right i'm gonna go ahead and pick up these two t-shirts here so i got i found a mm mma elite t-shirt which do pretty well um and i got it for 1.99 so not a not not bad for 199 should be able to get at least 15 for that one and then this old navy ramon shirt don't know who the heck that is but should be able to get about 12 dollars for this one and i'm also paying 199. i'm at found and cherish i'm pretty sure i'm gonna get in trouble but that itch hasn't been scratched yet all right i think my itch has been scratched with this score right here the olympus stylus zoom 140 deluxe and they're charging six dollars it's going for anywhere between 100 well 80 to 170 so it's crazy pre-owned so definitely gonna grab this all right guys so my wife is probably gonna be mad but i'm happy because i found me some this one didn't have anything in it this is like a, a genesis game they have these hidden rambo 3 nothing in it but the case goes for about 20 i actually he had it for seven dollars and i got it for free he gave it to me shinobi is in here don't know what this is never heard of it there you go that game um five dollars for that one and then sonic the hedgehog 2 for sega genesis crazy let's go and then that big score on that camera they slipped on that one but i'll take that i have been getting blessed by the thrift gods and the garage sale gods for like a week or two now and i've been finding some insane stuff that camera sold in like two hours bruh and i paid six dollars for it and, I, and it sold for full asking price of 189 dollars and 99 cents plus shipping let's go man I am super hyped about that sale and especially the Sega Genesis stuff, man. I, Where do you find, what thrift store do you find Sega Genesis stuff, man? That's going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to smash that like button. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Turn on notifications so you don't miss a single video we make. And until next time, this is X House. Make sure to stay on your grind and make that money, baby.